Hey, what's up? Hello and welcome. My name is Maya and today we have an episode of Whimsy Stories and this is little Jameson. He's so cute. So last episode we had Jameson, our firstborn, well, Noelle's firstborn, and I'm so excited to get started and show you guys all the changes with this family and I'm also excited to finally get to play with Jameson as an infant and show you all the updates that we've been doing in Noelle's life. If you're excited, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, but yeah, we're gonna get started. All right, right now, Jameson is all happy and sleep in his new bedroom. I don't even remember what trait he got. He got calm, which we need some calm in our life, but this is his bedroom. I mentioned last episode we were going to move, and we did end up moving you all. We now live in Evergreen Harbor in a townhome. We're living our suburban life right now. That's what Noelle's, um, I guess, Noelle's mindset is right now, is to like give her kid a staple life. But this is the house right here. I got it from the gallery. Well, this is the lot, I should say. I got it from the gallery. We have two other neighbors who are both couples. One of the couples has kids, so... It's going to be like a really family gameplay until probably Noelle messes it up because we know how Noelle is and her being committal, not really likely. And I want to show you guys something that happened right before I started recording. I loaded into the save and they decided to woohoo together. I promise you, I did not make Santos and Noelle woohoo. In fact, I was just trying to make them closer so they can just sleep in the same bed together because they didn't want to sleep in the same bed because they don't have a title. And then Santos took it upon himself to ask her to woohoo or Noel asked him. I don't even know who asked who. All I just saw them going to the bed and I was like, what? And no protection was used. So lovely, lovely. But we're going to start their, I guess, day. Um, she is on family leave right now. Well, and she was off anyway today. So we didn't have to go to work today, though. He has work. So we're going to get noel up and she's gonna make breakfast and everything but the first thing she's gonna do is put jameson down here so he's down here with her now noel is not like committal when it comes to relationships but she does want to take care of her son and be a good mom so a uh, shout out to her josh has not like been over to be fair though i haven't played a lot off camera i just like did some decorating and stuff but josh has not called or anything like that so i don't know he's if he's gonna be in his baby's life but Part of the rules is that we can get child support. I'm going to see if the SMB um, bills mod is still working. Uh, so that way we can use that for child support for little Jameson from his dad. Because like, you know, we should be getting child support. Look at Noelle being like little, not little, but I guess Betty, Betty homemaker, I guess. Let's do fried eggs and toast. We'll do a uh, family size because we don't need that many leftovers santos is going to go to work today he's asleep right now i don't know they're not an item they didn't ask each other out they just wooed so i don't know if it's going to be like an actual relationship or do they just assume that they're in a relationship with each other or what the case may be but yeah in this little room i put the the juice fizzing machine because i didn't have anywhere else to put it but it's a decent sized house like it's a nice townhouse but I don't think it's Noelle's style, but she's going to just try to fake this happy life until it gets too much for her. And then we might have to, you know, leave Santos because she is a serial romantic. So we do still have to do that for her generation. So I don't know how long they're going to last. I was talking to my stream about Santos and I remember last episode I asked you all, what should we do? Uh, for Santos. Oh, he's gonna go to work without eating. Well, this is a terrible work outfit. Let me at least remove the accessories. But I was asking what should we do about Santos and Noel and if we should give Santos uh, like a trait that is, I guess, negative. But my stream made the good point that maybe he's just so perfect and Noel tries to find something to fault him on and that's how their relationship ends so i don't know if i'm gonna give him a negative trait like i planned but we'll see um let me remove all accessories from you okay that looks more like a teacher outfit there you go go to work uh and she finished breakfast but he didn't have time to eat it but she can eat and then we can do some things with jameson i want to work on oh he's pooping i want to work on some of his milestones and things today he's so so cute i think he's gonna look like his father but we'll see I don't think he has any like milestones or anything. He's just been here for one day. He did get his first visitor because her uncle Oakley came to check in on her and see how the move to 
evergreen has been because her uncle does live in Gen One's house. So he did come over off camera and that was his first visitor, uh, Jameson's first visitor. So, but I don't think he has any other milestones or anything like that, except for like first mile because they all get that. So we're going to have to do some things today. We're going to feed him right now and because he's starving and then we will do like some tummy time with him probably put him down for a nap or a bath or whatever she's just getting used to this mom lifestyle and because she woohooed without protection last night i'm hoping that she's not pregnant again i think it's way too soon even though i do want to have a kid with santos so i don't know but jameson is like the cutest little thing i love him Oh, and she's still mourning the loss of Sophie, her dog. And I was thinking maybe we will get a pet this episode. I just don't know what type of pet to get. Maybe a cat, actually, because they're easier to care for. I just have to find one. I mean, I can put the litter box and stuff down here. So I think we'll have room for a cat, but we just don't have the money right now. Maybe when Santos gets off of work, we'll have money for a cat. But we're going to put Jameson down here and do some tummy time. And then I think it's time for Jameson's nap. Yeah. So we'll do tummy time and then we'll put Jameson here for a nap after. I want to look at her skills and see what we have to work on. I believe it's charisma and mixology and juice fizzing for the skill, right? So we have to do some juice fizzing today. And maybe she's thinking like, okay, I can start selling to make money because there is a marketplace. Where is it? over here and we can start bringing jameson to the marketplace with us this machine though has been like glitching since we moved okay it's working now let's load ingredients and see if we can work on that after we put him down for a little nap oh he got lift head exciting exciting he's so cute you guys gave me the name jack daniel and if we have another boy i think i'll give him that name eventually because i do want to give her like a few kids maybe three or four children um and it's probably all going to be by different dads to be honest um you're supposed to be putting jameson to sleep but you know what if jameson wants to go to sleep in on his play mat he can because he is tired let's make we have a lot of grapes so let's do some grape beer i guess it's weird all right let's start brewing 52 simoleons to brew that's crazy. Um, we also need to work on mixology so we can practice making drinks down here. I guess this is allegedly the property owner. My property and her owners never work, so chances are tomorrow is probably going to be a new one. And there's a vendor. Where's like, do you see vending? Somewhere you can do that. I don't know. But I really do like the neighborhood we live in. I think it's a cool one. I don't think, like I said, I don't think she'll stay in this neighborhood per se. Oh, and he got reach. He's reaching his little milestones. I love him. But I don't think she's going to stay in this neighborhood uh, for long. Maybe like a few episodes will play here. But when her and Santos end up splitting up, spoiler, they will not be together forever. They don't even go out. But I do think I'm going to ask him out because we have to have eight boyfriends by the end of this challenge. So, or girlfriends too. So I do want to get that done. Why is her brother calling? Oh, for a chat? Sure. Sure. All right, I need to have her use the bathroom. Ooh, this pregnancy test. I think we should just do it now and hope she's not pregnant because then that would leave her with freaking two infants. And I had the, the idea that Santos is going to want to get married if he finds out she's pregnant. And I think that would be just too much for her. She's like married. I'm so young. Like we could just like live together. We don't have to be married. And I think that's maybe where their arguments are going to start. But for right now, they're probably in like bliss. They don't even go out yet. I gotta remember to do that when he gets home. Oh, Ash spread gossip about Love, their sister. I wonder what Love did this time. Not even this time. Love is usually a good girl, so I don't even know. Okay, wait, hold on. This is big news. This is big news if she's pregnant or not. Y'all, I am nervous. Usually, I don't care if my Sims have kids or not. But right now, it's not the time, not the space. Eventually, I do want her to have kids with Santos. So we're gonna hope for a negative pregnancy test now. Nope, never mind. Never mind. Yeah, your second kid. Her face is a mood. Okay. Then, oh, and she's not happy about it. I, I do think she would definitely not be happy about this second kid. She wasn't really happy about the first, but the second one, she's like, oh, no, 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 no. I love Jameson, but I don't want to have another kid. The mere concept of carrying a baby or being impregnated and manipulated by unwelcome hormone spikes, seeing seeing it change the body makes noelle sick to her stomach oh yeah she doesn't want to be pregnant she doesn't even want to tell santos i don't even know i feel like 
Noel wouldn't want to continue the pregnancy, but Santos would kind of, I wouldn't use the word force, but like definitely convince her to continue it. And um, I think that's a lot of arguments. I'm going to start from that, but we'll see. I hope you guys like the townhouse though. I like it. I mean, we have a second room for the kid. We can just move this outside. I'm hoping for another boy and we can just put them in the same room. But, oh goodness, she's pregnant again. We also need, oh, level two beer brewing. Beer brewing and juice fizzing is the same skill. I just have base mental, so it overrides it and changes it to beer. But, um, yeah, just let me know what we should name Noelle's brand. I want to give her like a brand name and everything. And I think today we're going to go, oops, today we're going to go and sell her, like her bear. So, and she had condoms. It's just, I never unpacked it. Well, now we have them and hopefully she actually uses them. I also, I wanted to spend today's episode trying to find her mom and building that relationship up but i think i might save it for next episode because now we have to deal with the pregnancy this episode so yeah i think that's more important to focus on okay we're going to open this up because we have grape we have like individual beers we can sell so let's grab that stuff these are all things that can be thrown out Right now, she's sad from the pregnancy. I can't believe she's having another kid so soon. I did not think it was going to be so soon. But now she's hungry because, you know, she's pregnant. So I'm going to have her get some food. Santos should be home soon. I don't even think she's going to tell Santos right away. She kind of, she kind of wants to be gone when Santos gets here. But I don't think she is. Maybe she can, like, sneak out with Jameson and they can go. Or maybe she'll leave Jameson here like, oh, you're back. I have to run out real quick and then we'll go. I think we'll do that. So we'll leave Jameson here with Santos. And it's like she kind of like he came in and she's going to run out and be like, I got to run out. I'm going to go sell some beer at the local stall. She kind of just doesn't want to run into him and tell him that she's pregnant, especially because she knows he's going to be so happy and want to keep it. And she doesn't want to keep the baby. But I think she eventually is because we did say she's going to end up having kids with Santos anyway. So might as well. Might as well just go through this pregnancy, right? Even though she doesn't want to. Okay, he's back home. Perfect. He made only one ninety eight today. Not a lot of money, but that will have to do. I don't even know if he's going to come here. That vendor has been sitting here all day. He's like, Noelle, you home? Jameson, you sleep? And she's like, I, I got to run out. <laughs> I'm running out. So he's coming in like, uh, Noelle, you in here? She's like in the bathroom, throwing up and stuff. Um, she's going to just give him a, a quick hug. And like, she's not angry at him, but she's going to give him a quick hug. Like, mm, welcome home. But I got to go run out real quick, okay? And he's trying to tell her about his day and work and everything. But she's just not into it because the thought of this pregnancy is like weighing heavy on her mind. But yeah, okay. We're going to head out to the marketplace and see if we can sell some things. Oh, look at her giving him a massage. He should be giving you the massage because you are pregnant. Um, and they gained a sentiment. Okay, I was just making sure. Wait, it's not ready. How long is it going to take? This machine is so broken. I don't even think it's working. Okay, she's like, can you watch Jameson? And he was like, it's not watching Jameson. He's our son. Like, he's like that type of guy. He's just so nice. But Noel is Noel, so... Let's see how long she lasts with this guy. But let's head over to the marketplace. All right, here's the marketplace. I put this marketplace down in this world. I just felt like it fit our story and what we're doing. And right here is like a juice fizzing, fizzing one. So I want to see if I can put our juices here. Okay, we can put our juices on the table, I think, and sell it that way, hopefully. And hopefully people actually show up. So let's come over here, tend the table. Oh, look, it's our property owner, but she's a vendor. Her f her mom's husband is here, Riley. I'm pretty sure they're married. Look how, okay, if you guys remember, Kira, we can't hang out right now. We're doing, we're doing, we're doing a job here. But if you guys remember Riley from Gen 1, well, Gen 1 and Gen 2, and this is who, <laughs> he looks so dazed. This is who her mom ended up with. I don't know if they're married. Yeah, they are married and they have two kids, Anita, and they also have Charlie, who's a high school student, two girls who they ended up keeping after she gave Noelle away. But if he comes to our table, maybe we can talk to him, but I don't know. We'll see. All right. Hopefully people are going to come and buy things. Oh, I wanted to mark up the prices. 
300% as always. Hopefully people start buying things. This will be a good way for her to work on her Christmas skill too. Oh, you, girl, you look like you would like some beer. Friendly introduction to these people. They look so dazed. Oh, she is dazed. It's not that she just looks dazed. Maybe it's a juice fizzing community, which is perfect because then they can they can buy stuff. Oh, you don't want to buy anything? Boo. Oh, we can actually give you a sales pitch. How about you buy our beer? It's homemade. Ooh, somebody did. Only for 16 simoleons though, but it's something. Ooh, 224 actually. They are buying our things. I don't know if we made this one. They're like, what's the name of your, your beer? And that's when she's like, um, I just realized I don't have a name for my bear which i need help with noel is named after christmas because her father named all of his kids after the holidays so oh this is actually our neighbor over here not her having her own juice business too but this is nuhar i made her like oh i had like a whole creative sim video on her and her husband and i just never uploaded it the video but this is new heart i made her um maybe a few months ago and i was in i've been trying to figure out what series to put her in but i feel like she fit fit into this world her husband and her and i gave them kids but she's literally like lives like two house doors down to from us in the town home but she has her own juice fizzing business and you know so now she's a competition and you know i kind of want it <laughs> noelle to uh get with her husband eventually so hmm Hmm. Do we not have anything else to sell? He took over the table because we have nothing else to sell. Okay, Oakley. Yeah, because these are not our bears. That was like already on the table. But the candles are supposed to be over here and the bears over here. But her uncle is making candles now, taking after his mom. Maybe these are like candles from his mom. Made by Oakley. Listen, okay, I didn't mean for you to mark it up too. I want a candle, but why your your candles are so expensive? Because I decided to mark it up. Oh, this actually looks like um. Ah, is free love on? Is this counting as kisses? No, boo. I wish it was counted as kisses, because I would have just taken advantage of the fact that free love is on right now. I guess we can just do an enchanting introduction, and we can. Uh, she's not. First of all, her and um. Uh, santos don't go out yet i am gonna have santos ask her out as soon as he finds out she is pregnant but i just want to work on this so we're gonna just kiss a whole bunch of people's hands because i want to move on to the final part of it and i think it's just easier if you kiss hands it's like not that serious is it not counting okay it, it is counting okay i was like why is it not counting did it not work with this girl okay let's see if we can find someone else to kiss their hands we have to do three more sims see free love is on so i feel fine doing this here right it's not an issue i wish nuhar's husband is here because i do feel like noel does not care when people are in a relationship and she will take people's husbands i, I can see that for her wait hold on i need to give first of all girl we're not like friends for real, I just needed to get this aspiration done and we're here. So let's give him... Well, she's too sad to do an enchanting introduction. Sad about this pregnancy, huh? Girl, you're ruining it. Ooh, a vampire, though. You can get with the vampire. Girl. Oh, I didn't show you guys the upstairs. I think that's where, like, there's a area, like a cafe, so we can hire a vendor. We can even tend the counter if we want. And, yeah, there's, like, a bubble tea station up here and outside eating area i love this lot and then out here is like a whole bunch of stalls where people come you can order food and drink and and all of that so we're definitely going to be here often selling our own stuff we sold everything today which is crazy so we just have to keep making more but i'm trying to get to ooh, we're besties besties i wanted to she's too sad why do you have to be sad how long 11 um, can we call this at oh there's even like you can buy paintings here this is so nice these will look nice in our house yeah we're definitely gonna come here often but let me call the sadness hotline because girl i'm trying to finish this part of your aspiration so we can move on to the next part but you're making it difficult for me okay she's feeling confident now she's still sad but she's feeling a little girl i was gonna talk to you but the vampire left okay let's try to do it with not like literally do it but try to do a um a kiss with charlotte oh no she's a teen never mind i did not say that y'all Nuar is her neighbor though i'm gonna give her for now 
a friendly introduction. We're not going to try to kiss. Oh, she's feeling her stomach though. Maybe she is getting like making peace with being pregnant. I'm just going to have her introduce herself to Nuhar. She's like, hey, I think I saw you like by my house. And she's like, yeah, we, we're neighbors. So let me see. Nuhar thinks Noel is annoying though. And we think she's unattractive. So it's no, no relationship forming between these two. I want to see what she thinks of Nuhar's husband though. So like I said, Noelle is like not above. Like she doesn't respect her own relationship boundaries. So if somebody else is in like a relationship, it's not going to be like a deal breaker for her. Let's just give her a little rose. I should have done an enchanting introduction so we can just kiss her hands already. You want a rose? Okay, let's see. Did you like that? Did you like the rose? Her uncle's like, Noelle, why do you always flirt with people? <laughs> I think they'll get mad that we're flirting with both of them at the same time. But free love is on, so I think everyone is just really friendly in this neighborhood. Okay, finally, kiss hands. Jeez. We're not trying to be forever and ever with you. Okay, that should be eight. Yes, okay. Two more Sims. <laughs> Two more Sims, you all. Let me see if I can do anything with this Sim. Um, she's going to be mad, but you know what? This Sim is actually cute jenna but she's pregnant too maybe we can like bond over that the fact that we're pregnant no don't leave girly i know we're pregnant and tired but we got stuff to do maybe she is gonna leave okay she left boo mm -mm. let's give her a flirty introduction she's getting tired but this teen is selling all of their things like way to go charlotte making a lot of money oh well she's angry what does blow a kiss work if blow a kiss works, I'm going to be, like, ah, screaming. Also. I think it's only kiss hands. Okay, maybe we can do attempt to miss a toe kiss. <laughs> Noel is crazy. Is that nine? Yeah, okay, nine. Good. We're going to have, like, little romance bars with everyone. Oh, this is the vampire that I was trying to have a kiss with. So now we can go over. Let's talk to the vampire. And then she kissed ten sims. I think Santos is going to be like, it's nearly... One in the morning, Noel, and you're just getting home. But he has to get used to this, okay? That is Noel for you. She's a partier. And I feel like Nuhar is watching her do all this. Like, mm, I got to watch her around my man. She's definitely flirty, so. Okay, but we did all 10, finally, right? Yes, okay, finally. Um, Not her flirting with her, but it's free love, okay? It's not, it's not real. All right, but we have to have... Our last part of it is to have had eight boyfriends or girlfriends. We're going to ask, well, have Santos ask her out and earn gold on three dates. We're going to head home. I don't think she's going to tell Santos she's pregnant tonight, but I think she is going to tell him over dinner tomorrow. And he's going to be like, okay, we should make this official if you're going to have my kid. And she's like, wait, 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 have your kid. I thought we were going to like, you know not go full term with this pregnancy and maybe it will result in an argument who knows but yeah we're gonna head back home and i'll pick back up in the morning all right it's the next morning and he's putting jameson to sleep he woke up too early and is tired and he's just so good with jameson they're building their friendship up slightly but he does look at jameson as like a son of his which i love and he also is wondering like when did noel even get back because he was asleep when noel got home but i decided to have him work from home today because he wants to spend time with noel and jameson so we're gonna go i think he has to write a letter of recommendation and what's the other one create a lesson plan which i don't i think we do that on the computer but after he gets that done i think what we're gonna do why do you have this food in your inventory? I think once he gets that done, we're going to go out to eat with Noel. And it can be a day and hopefully we get gold on it. But he has like some questions from her. One, she's sleeping in tonight or today. He's noticed like she's been moody and stuff. And he just wants to know like what is going on. And hopefully she admits that she's pregnant to him. And we'll see how that goes. Yeah, right now she's in here still asleep. She came home late, still tired. That pregnancy is kicking her butt, so. But when he's done, he's going to come up here and wake her up. Like, do you want to go out to eat or something? You've been, like, sleep all morning. I've never went to a restaurant with an infant, so let's see how this goes. Um, I think I'm going to get, actually, I have a bassinet. Well, not a bassinet, a crib that is, like, um, it's kind of like this. It's draggable, but it's smaller, and it's, looks like a, it looks like a carriage. On a carriage, like a stroller. 
so hopefully i still have it yeah right here right here so that way we can have him come out with us and if anything he can sleep in here if he gets tired i don't know if we have room anywhere for it maybe i mean you always leave your strollers by the door right i'm not a parent but that's where people tend to leave their strollers is by the door so i'm just gonna leave it here oh it's like kind of peeking through a little here okay good oh is she up she's actually feeling fine with the preg like with the child on the way today maybe it's like slowly hitting her that she's gonna be pregnant and she woke up without him waking her up so she's gonna go down here i think she's still her second trimester is in four hours so she has to make a decision if she's keeping the baby or not so right now she's not really showing her boobs they get bigger though so i'm sure he noticed that but she's probably wondering why he's still home like express relief over a healthy birth i didn't even know you can do that but she's like why are you why are you home like he's like oh i took today to stay home because i wanted to go out to eat do you want to go out to eat she's like actually i'm quite literally starving i'm gonna get ready and stuff so we're gonna get ready to go out for breakfast on a nice little date i don't know if we can actually invite jameson maybe oakley came over and watched jameson for them now that i think about it because if we make it a date i don't think jameson can come but maybe i can like still have him come we really need a, a name for her brand i'm like what did we get 152 simoleons from forgetting that he is downstairs working and like i said we need all that money a second baby is coming i'm so scared for that second baby i'm hoping for another boy so we can use the name jack daniel but if it's a girl, I'm going to name her Hennessy. <laughs> so at least I have a name, though, if it is a girl. No, girl, stop. Stop eating. Stop eating. You're not supposed to be eating right now. You're, she's like, I'm pregnant and starving. First of all, he doesn't even know you're pregnant. Oh, my goodness. Your boobs. Your boobs are, like, leaking. Come up here and breastfeed. He has to be hungry. Him waking up is the cutest. Let's go breastfeed him because your boobs are, like, on fire. And he's hungry, too. So that works out for us. I just want to check, is brew bearing, oh, up to level 5. I was like, please tell me it's not a level 10 skill. Okay, up to level 5. Not too bad. Mm. She almost done with the lesson plan. Like, he's been working all morning. He's getting hungry too, so. Aw, she's in here doing tummy time with her little boy. Anytime she's around her son, she just instantly gets happy. Oh, he finished. So after this, we can go out. So I have a mod that lets you call a babysitter. It doesn't really work per se but like i like doing it because it just makes it more realistic and the babysitter she's gonna call she has like a lot of romance with people um maybe kiara but i feel like oakley is the closest because he lives here but we can't even call oakley savannah <gasps> why can't we call oakley i guess we can't call oakley maybe he's not available to babysit for us so maybe destiny destiny is her like father's cousin so it's her cousin too and they're closer in age so we're gonna invite destiny to come watch jameson and introduce them and everything before going out on our date she also needs to change for said date hmm which we put her in i mean it's cold she put her in the cold weather i need to give her more outfits oh and we need to dye her hair how am i forgetting that she's supposed to have her hair dyed so actually instead of having her change her outfit we're gonna have her plan an outfit and have her listen you guys are gonna eat when you go out <laughs> eat when you go out okay and her cousin is coming to babysit she's like of course i can come babysit oh, she's here to babysit little little jameson where is she does that mean okay he does know destiny and i like calling for babysitters because it like makes my infants know the kit know their family and i don't have to do the whole introduction thing but he's coming in like are you ready for the date <laughs> yeah i am well actually no i need to get changed and she's dyeing her hair so all right i decided to go blonde for her for a few reasons the first one is because blonde is like the color that she's bleaching her hair so she can her filling her belly is so cute so she can um like put colors on it so her hairstylist was probably like just bleach it for now you don't want to put too much damage on it so we're going blonde and also she doesn't know how santos will feel with her and getting bright colored hair he met her with her black hair and honestly i feel like with santos she feels like she can't be who she wants to be because he's more like proper and he's more i guess put together than her so she kind of feels intimidated by him even though he doesn't care 
about what she wears and stuff. I feel like she thinks he will. But I gave her a new outfit for a date. You're not eating this, Santos, okay? Because we're going out to eat. So let's go um, and ask on date. Santos, stop eating. Ugh, she's making all this food. Like, please. Oh, yeah. You love, you love the new hair? She came downstairs. Destiny was like, oh, my goodness, the hair. Yeah, thanks. So, do you want to go out? You said, you said, he's like, I love the hair color. I think he will be fine with whatever she chooses to dye her hair, but she gets in her own head. That's the issue. She gets in her own head and she second guesses herself. But we're going to go to the veggie caboose because it's right here in town and I want to explore more of the lots in this save. And I am going to add, I did add a bar so we can go and bartend there to make some money too. And I might add like more lots in these community centers if we plan on staying here for a while. Okay, we're here on our date. They're both starving. So we're going to try to find them a seat quickly. If we can. Maybe request this table over here. I love the caboose. Anything somebody does with the caboose, I love. It always turns out so nice. So, but this is my first time at this lot. So I'm going to take a look around. They have like... I guess like a TV area. Actually, I've been to this lot already. I'm seeing this my first time. We've been here. I'm looking at it like, mm, because Gen 1 lived in this world. Duh, I've been here before. But I haven't been here in a while. Oh, this is actually our neighbor. He's a doctor. So I don't know why he's hosting right now. Well, at least I think he's a doctor. But this is our neighbor, I care. And I care is um Newhart's husband so we're gonna give him a cheerful introduction I want to see what she thinks of him and everything I feel so bad for Santos because they're not gonna end up together but yeah she's like Santos I think that's our neighbor you should go say hi so I'm gonna have them both well oh, they don't get along but that never stopped Noel huh she has another neighbor, so don't worry. But she thinks he's unattractive, so it looks like she's not breaking up that relationship with um, with I Care and Newhart. But she, her other neighbor is somebody she already has like romance with. It is Bryson, who is a bouncer in San Maishuno. And they used to like work at the same club together. I, I mentioned him like maybe a few episodes ago, but she has romance with him. Well, now he's her neighbor and he goes out with this girl, India. So, oh, Newhar's here. Like, it, no, watch out for her. I care. She is a flirt. Stop spreading rumors about us. <laughs> but let's go over here and sit together and order for table. Oh, this is their son. He's so cute. And I think they have an infant too. So I kind of want to do like a play date type of thing with them, especially because now we know we're not going to break up this relationship. But let me, she's going to order water and he's going to be like, I do order water, especially her, somebody that likes to drink, but he's not a big drinker. So he's going to get iced tea anyway. And then they are starving. So, and it's a veggie restaurant, which is fine. Ooh, meatless Monte Cristo sounds good. And he can get maybe a veggie burger we'll do that but this is i forgot his name because i made him a while ago i didn't make him when i made over her and her husband but his name is nalish rafi webster so nalish is their son so cute and i think they have a daughter as well so we'll have we'll have to meet the neighbors and everything girl you're walking through the wall but i want i want us to get a gold date because we have to for um Girl, sit down, sit. I don't even know where you are, but we have to get a gold date for her aspiration anyway. And we have to share the news that we're pregnant with him, so. But the main thing we wanna do is sit and talk to our date. Let's compliment his outfit. Like, you look good, Santos. He's like, you do too. I love the blonde. It looks great on you. Did we not order our food? I don't think we ordered. Or I don't think they came. No, we did order. So why does it say order? This is not clicked off. Oh, we're waiting to place the order. Love is calling. I kind of didn't... Well, okay, he's going to place the order then, I guess, when they come. Girl, sitting in and talking on the phone in the middle of your date? How rude, Noelle. The blonde on her is, like, kind of jarring to me. I'm not used to seeing her blonde. You guys have to let me know what color do you think she should go for next? Because the blonde is just the placement um, for now. So you guys have to let me know. He's like, Noelle, can you please get off the phone so we can talk? Okay, she was like, yeah, 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 I hang up. <laughs> All right, we have to socialize 10 times. Um, oh no, somebody's dying here. Way to ruin our date. And wait, hold on. Who's being mean? 
All right, hold on. She's dying and he's yelling at her. I did not make him yell at her. I don't know why he's yelling at her. Maybe because she's staying on her phone. I'm going to ignore the sim dying, y'all. I don't feel like having my sim sad and going to watch a sim dying. I mean, rest in peace to that sim, but I ain't dealing with it. Where's where's the sim that's dying? Sweetheart, just go. You're ruining the day. Just go. I'm sorry, but um, yeah. he's yelling at her like about like kids and stuff. Did Do you think he found the pregnancy test? But now she's hurt by him. Stop. She's discussing the fear of commitment. I feel like he's trying to ask her out and she's like, I'm like a little nervous to commit. Okay, we need to tell him we're pregnant, y'all. Cause I feel like he knows. So let's share big pregnancy news with him. She keeps touching her belly too. And he's like, um, why do you keep doing that? <sighs> Santos, you're right. I am pregnant, okay? <laughs> They're having an unpleasant conversation. How unfortunate. Hurt sentiment. Noel feels wronged by Santos. Y'all, I try to make him a good person, but he's just yelling at her. I don't know why, but we'll see. But he knows now that we're pregnant. He seems happy about it. And I think Noelle kind of wants to keep the kid now. I don't know if she does, but we can. I wonder if he can ask her to marry him. First, let's, he's like, okay, you're pregnant. We need to make this official. I'm tired of like us just living together without a title. So ask to be girlfriend. Her uncle being here is funny. Y'all, we still have not ordered our food. Let me have her go to the bathroom now because she really has to go. And he's going to try to order for table again. No one wants to take our order. Oh, there is a pending order. So I guess... Wait, let me cancel this. Where's our waiter? They said it would come to our, our table soon to take our order. The waiter's out here dropping stuff. That's what, what they're doing. Who are you out with, Oakley? I'm watching you. We can order a bottle. Interesting. Oh, he already took our order. Never mind. Oops. Sorry, Matthias. I think he did. Is that our food? Oh, here's your order. Yeah. Okay, come here. Sit. And we're going to eat. I don't think he asked her out, though. So he has to hurry up and do that. Oakley just sitting here, standing here. Well, I don't think she's ready to tell her family she's pregnant either because she doesn't even know if she's going to keep the baby or not. But I want him to ask her out. But I think he's going to get up to do that. And I just... I don't have time for that. We need to also socialize three times about the the food. So discuss food flavors, enthuse about the meal. Oh, did we get, we got gold already. Okay, well, we don't have to worry about getting gold anymore. We did that. But I guess he might've told Oakley like, oh yeah, she's pregnant. Oh, let me actually do that. The free love has got to stop. It has, has it has to stop. Free love is a hot mess. But let's see if we can tell him that we're having a kid because I think that would tie them into keeping it once the rest of the family knows. So he's like, oh, yeah, Noel's pregnant. Uh, ignore the flirting, you guys. It's just free love is on. But yeah, you won't believe it. We're having a kid. Noel's like, why would you tell him? I didn't say if I wanted to keep the kid or not. So now she's kind of tied into keeping this kid. And I want to say Santos kind of did that on purpose. He knew she was on the fence about wanting another kid, but let's ask her out then we can end this I'm talking about the move and everything with her but he's like we need to make this official so he wants to get married he, he's always thought of i'm gonna marry the mother of my kids and i like i said people always think the best out of noel oh and he got loyal yeah see see what i mean he's like yeah we're gonna get married one day raise our kids together and noel is starting to get scared because she doesn't do commitment well so here we are i wish ask her about her pregnancy what does she think about it i wonder if she's gonna be honest like nice of you to ask i'm in my second and child master i'm okay with be having kid being pregnant is hard on me letting her know, him know like it's it's hard to be pregnant and he's like i'm gonna take care of you don't worry so right now their relationship seems stable i don't know how long it's gonna last because you know we did see him get a little snappy with her and insult her and stuff and yell at her um, I think he just wanted her to tell the truth about the pregnancy because he knew something was going on. But we're going to... Is she? <gasps> Why is she smoking while pregnant? This was in her inventory. This would definitely get him so mad. So mad. So I, I want him to yell at her like, what are you doing? Because I did not tell her to do this. Stop. Noel, stop. Honestly, I don't think Noel's the type to do this, but apparently, apparently this is stressing her out so much. At the dinner table, 
Noelle is a hot mess. This was in her inventory from high school and I just never got rid of it. I didn't think she was really gonna do something with it. Jesus, Noelle. He's like, why are you smoking while pregnant? Are you kidding me? Not with my child, Noelle. Oh, of course, their, their romance took a hit. She's not gonna take this lying down though because she, maybe she was prescribed it by her doctor. So she's gonna insult him like, why would I choose to do this on purpose? The doctor said it's best for me because this pregnancy has been hard on me. I don't know how true that is, but whatever. <laughs> We're gonna give up our table. I guess we don't have to pay. And already they're not in the best of mood. Noelle decided to smoke at the dinner table. What is wrong with her? What is wrong with her? Okay, and she was like, you know what? I'm gonna go to work. She has work today, but she just never went because I, is it a holiday or is she on family leave? I don't know. I think she's on family leave, but we're gonna just have her go to work. She's like, I'm going to work because, um, oh, she got a baby kick. That's so cute. But she's going to work because she doesn't want to go home. She's like, I'm gonna go bartend. He's like, what the hell is wrong with her? Let's head home with him. Um, I just realized we don't know the gender of this baby yet because she didn't go to an ultrasound. So we're going to go into ultrasound tomorrow morning. But right now she's like, I'm going to work. I'm not, I'm not dealing with you yelling at me. So they're off to a rocky start. You guys off to a rocky start. All right. It's the next day and he got promoted to mentor teacher, which we need it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> he is going to work from home today. We're going to get her up because little miss, Mr is all sad he needs his first bubble bath today oh he's all sneezy he's so cute oh she's doing peekaboo that's so cute let's breastfeed him he did get roll over to tummy too last night and he got laughed just unlocked just now so he's doing fine he's our, our little guy's doing fine he's so cute okay we're going to feed him though and give him his first bubble bath we do have to do our ultrasound and stuff today so we do have a lot of things planned. He's eating mac and cheese for breakfast and <laughs> Destiny left our kitchen a mess. Okay, let's clean this up. This is about to spoil, so we're gonna just clean this up too. And this, Jameson is getting his first bath. I hope our kid doesn't come out with blonde hair. If our kid comes out with blonde hair, it means it's supposed to have black hair. I just realized that when her hair is changed, it's her kid's genetics may be messed up, but oh, cute. Move, move, move your head, Noel. We're here for Jameson. You're gonna have a little brother or sister. I don't know when he ages up. Let me see. We still have three days, so we're gonna have two infants at the same time. Somebody please pray for me. Pray for me. All right, you are done cleaning. You need to do your job. Maybe we can do conduct research before going to our ultrasound appointment. Oh, we need an actual research machine. Oh, and he's shoveling look at him go why are you shoveling somebody else's yard oh no he's doing a snow angel he's not even shoveling cute jameson you're all babe okay suspicious craft beer not even a good one we're gonna load more ingredients but i'm gonna put these in the fridge before they spoil all right let's start brewing but we don't have a research machine so i think what i'm gonna do instead is because i'm not going i'm not going to a university and i'm not buying one so i'm gonna have him write letter of recommendation and then i'll just cross it off like he conducted research because i'm not doing all that with him but we're gonna have noelle take a shower get ready for this appointment later on and we are going to i just realized we have like three bathrooms i thought we didn't have enough bathrooms here but we have a whole nother bathroom right here i was wondering like what the kids were gonna do i don't know why i didn't even notice this bathroom <laughs> but i didn't but we do have another bathroom for when the kids age up if we even stay in this house i feel like santos name is on the lease so i don't know when the relationship goes i don't know if we're gonna still be here noelle's um hand was rested on her baby's bump when bam her tanning hum human decided to throw a swift kick to her rib cage oof that has to hurt oh she's of course playing peekaboo with him he's so cute let's play with toys look at toys and then tell me time She's like, so are you ready for our appointment soon? He was like, yeah, yeah, I just have to do some things. Oh, he got grabbed. Our little man is going. He's growing up. So cute. I do want to, we have to convince someone to volunteer time too for a job. Her bump is like non-existent. Or am I going crazy? I don't know if it's like the clothes she's wearing, but she's in her third trimester in two hours. Two hours. 
Honestly, I feel like write letter of recommendation is longer than conducting research. Jameson is up here just entertaining himself. Oh, is our collection done? Oh yeah, come collect this. Ooh, he got creep. Cute. He's moving along. I do want to get into crawling because I finally got one infant to cry crawling on my live stream. And I just want to get all of my infants crawling now. But she's taking a nap. She's like, are you almost done? We have to go. And I think he is almost done. Okay, let's get her up because he needs to ask the volunteer time. And he's like, let's go. Is her stomach could finally hear? Yeah, she finally has a little bump. So he's like, you want to come volunteer at the school? I think it would be a great opportunity for you to talk to kids. Oh, no. Now she's yelling at him. Their relationship is just so, just so interesting. But okay, we finished asking the volunteer time. <laughs> we need to reach level two logic to get a promotion, but I think he's fine for now. Because we're not going to honestly be playing with him for too long. But we are going to head off to our ultrasound appointment with these two and figure out what they're having last minute because she's in her third trimester now. So let's head off there. She's here, very angry, wanting to take a nap. No, 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 no. We're going to figure this out real quick, real quick. Oh, we can get blood work first. I always do that for my Sims. And then we can get an ultrasound. Um, yes, please. We want to figure out the gender of our baby. I like that the doctor is asking her before. He's like, we just got to do some blood work from you. And then we're going to see, um, all done. You'll get your results back tomorrow. But we should start our ultrasound with Clinton. Have Santos come in here. I'm so excited to finally figure out what she is having. She's like, uh, I know what an ultrasound entails. This is my second kid. Hopefully it's one baby in there. Oh, she just figured out what she's having. Okay, one healthy baby. I'm looking for the the, like the gender here. Okay, when I exit, it's going to show me what she's having. And she's having a girl. I wanted a boy, but a girl. She's having a girl. That's so cute. Her and Santos. How cute. She's like, look, Santos, look, it's our girl. I think this pregnancy is definitely different than the first one, though. I mean, her and her baby father argue, but it's not as bad as it was with Josh. So I'm happy about that. But I think Santos is just so happy about his baby coming in. And I am so sorry to be leaving you all on a cliffhanger, but we are not having this baby this episode. Even though I want to name the baby Hennessy, I do want to get some feedback from you all if you guys want me to name her Hennessy or if you have different names for this baby. Uh, I don't know who's taking over next gen. You all seem to want Jameson to take over next gen. I think I have to look at next gen's rules to figure out which baby I'll lean towards. I do think she's going to have like maybe one or even two more babies after this with different Sims. So spoiler, her and Santos won't work out. But as you can already see, they get into arguments without me making them get into arguments. They argue with each other. And now every couple argues, but right before this baby is coming, I don't know about all of that. Uh, so next episode, we'll start off with the baby being born, like right in the beginning. I don't know if her and Santos will make it through next episode. You'll have to let me know what you think down below. But I had so much fun and I can't wait for baby girl to show up next episode. I'm so excited. Also, Jameson will be aging up to a toddler next episode. So we have a lot of things going on for this family or for Noel's generation let me know what you're thinking down below and also let me know what you want for a juice fizzing business for noel if you reach the end of the video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to keep up with this series and the other series on my channel but i will be seeing you guys next time bye now